that they were told about certain things that I've done um, in the community and some of those things I can be incriminated for. Um, Jacob told me that if I don't go to the FBI first, then they would come after me, they would incarcerate me, they would take my children away from me because there are things that they were told about me um, that, that could incriminate me. I can't really speak for why other people did it. I know that a lot of them had their own personal anger issues with Malachi. I want to state that nobody that left the community left because they were molested. That was never a reason why anybody left because they were molested or because he was doing things to them that they did not agree to. Nobody left because um, he was doing any, any criminal acts. That was never the reason for anybody to leave. Everybody left because they wanted to leave, because they got fed up. I left because I wanted a new life. I, it just wasn't for me anymore. Um, some people did get kicked out, but it was never because of any child molestation issues. Nobody ever left because they felt that they were molested. There was no child that ever, ever made a statement that I want to leave because Malachi is molesting me. That never took place. That never happened. Um, in conclusion, um, it's really, really time for the truth to come out. Um, this is going on two years, or I think it ha actually has been two years. So many people have suffered. Malachi is suffering day by day um, because of this, and it's really, really not fair. I really, really believe that somebody has to come up with the truth. And like I said, every day I think about him suffering. Every day I think about how, how wrong it is, what we've, what we've all done, how wrong it is. Um, every day I think about what happened to all of the lives of, of those children. Um, so this, this is why I'm, I'm, putting, I'm putting my statement on record, because it's the right thing to do. Um, and like I said, um, I want the truth to come out. I, I can't be afraid anymore. I can't feel pressured anymore. I can't say that, um, you know, I can just go on with the rest of my life knowing that I'm hiding the truth, I'm holding the truth. I think it's time for it to come out. It has to come out. Uh, it is imperative for everyone to get involved. If no more than getting on the UNNM.com website and finding out what's really happening, the true story of what's going on, because if this could happen to our chief, it can happen to anybody. And that's one thing that we need everyone to know. Um, we're extending ourselves out to uh, all of the civil rights and human rights and... Uh, one minute. Yeah, uh, we, we're just here to, to make, set the record straight when um, it's time to, to fight. We need uh, everyone's support especially when it comes to uh, our people coming together and, and, and dealing with the hearsay. If you want to, like the brother said, you want to deal with the facts of the case and find out for yourself as opposed to listening to the media, listening to uh, words of rebellious people or just want, would like to slander. Just get the facts for yourself so you have a, a firm foundation and know for yourself what's going on in this case so okay. we can free our chief. Thank you.